There's a lot of change happening at Auditorium Shores along Ladybird Lake. The change will impact where you run, walk the dog, or even just hang out. Yeah, the city of Austin is working with an advisory firm to finish a study on how to make it a better park for you and your family. Our Sophia Beausoleil is live in South Austin with an update. Good morning. Hi, good morning, Kate. Well, if you've been on Riverside and you try to take the dog out to Auditorium Shores, you'll be greeted with this fence right behind me. Uh, as you know, they've been working on the grass and the irrigation system for the past couple of months. But today's meeting is to talk about not only this, but the entire area and what the future looks like for the next five to 20 years. So take a look at this map. This is to give you a better perspective of where we are talking about. The study looks at the off-leash area directly across Riverside from Butler Park. Park, the West Lawn or the Middle Lawn across from the Palmer Event Center and the East Lawn or the event space across from the Long Center. So the city along with Austin Parks Foundation and Tour Partners want your say when it comes to the beginning ideas to long-term infrastructure and designs to improve this area. So they also want you to weigh in on an updated traffic study on Riverside Drive and how to ease congestion. So in May, the study recommended creating a dedicated traffic management division under the Austin Police Department. It'd be made up of non-sworn staff specifically trained to manage and direct traffic. The study says traffic is a major issue, especially during events and people trying to get in and out of the parking garage. And there's also an issue with the crowd spilling out into the street. So the study also went on to say that it's not cost effective to pay officers to direct traffic. They say that their specialty is to help enforce the laws and police the area. And instead, they could hire a staff that would be trained specifically to help manage the traffic. Now, remember, this is all a study, and that's what they want your input on tonight. So that starts at 6 o'clock at the Palmer Event Center. And all of this will be presented to City Council in October. So again, you'll have your chance to have your say, and we have more information on our website, kxan.com. Reporting live from South Austin, Sophia Beausoleil, KXAN News.